I get very special guests for the house today. Very special because they be queens and I they like associate myself with queens. You understand? Yeah. So, and these ladies are beautiful. So, we'll be meeting the first one, the day four in number. So, fasting your seatbelt, not come off for it. You know, as beads on the bean, I say they always make sense. And let's meet my very, very first special guest. Her name, not precious, but I'll let her do the rest of the introduction. How are you doing, precious? I'm very well. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome to the studio. Thank so you. tell us, you sabi speak Fijian English? Of course. Mm. Uh, why not? Nice one. Nguano. <laughs> Make a carry go. <laughs> so I beg introduce yourself. Tell us uh face of Zikel waiting you be okay. and everything else. So just tell viewers where they helps. Okay. So my name na precious Chemaka Zurumba mm. and I be face of Zikel top model. You know, mm -hmm. very beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, black beauty. Yes. <laughs> All right, so apart from the uh, facts, say be face of Zikel top model, yeah. what do you do again? What do you do? So I'm um, a content creator, also a makeup artist nice. and a hairstylist. Ah, yes. so I see why you came this far. Because <laughs> sometimes when you sabi do makeup, you go day very, very, very easy. easy to do for yeah. your own face. Yes. So how was the experience like, you know, competing to be face <laughs> of Zikel? It was fun, okay. draining, and let me just leave it at fun and draining because uh -huh. almost you know when when you enter camp like mm -hmm. you see a lot of girls and you're like do I even stand a chance? Yeah, that kind of feeling. <laughs> I, you understand. So it was it was something, but I mean we're here now. So. We're here. Yes. Meaning you did well. You did amazingly well. And for you to come out top four, yeah. Because they did four in number, like I talk. So she's amongst the top four. For her to have come out top four, meaning you really, really did your best. I saw all the girls. I saw the girls. We come. I see the girls. Then we compete, and I know say they be fine, fine, correct, Thank correct girls. Girl. So. so you did well. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and so they're much. going forward. So what do you go use this position when you get as face of Zikel top model? What do you plan to use and? take to for the society so first of all i want to tell young girls out there say you can be anything or mm. anything you want to do for this life yeah. don't allow anybody tell you otherwise mm. because i know how long i've been wanting to do this and i mean i'm here right now so anything you want to do you feed do um so that's what i want to use this platform to tell young girls like right. me all that right. you can achieve anything you want to as long as you set your mind to do it nice one as yeah. long as you set your mind to do it you can definitely achieve anything you want and another thing another factor will really help most of us nigerian young stars achieve what we set our hearts to achieve now the fact that our parents they support us so i go yes. ask precious now if her family give her give her their full support how was that they gave me the best support uh. like i can't <laughs> even i can't even begin to talk about it mm. like my sisters because we're four girls my sisters nice. my my mom you know it was just really it was just something emotional for me because when I won, they couldn't make it down here, mm. so it was just my friend. So by the time I called my mom, she said, yeah, I won. The way she screamed, it was yeah. like, she, the first thing she said is, God truly answers prayers. That's and true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my family were just, they were just the best at nice during one. this period for me. Yeah. Interesting. All right, so finally, your message to the organizers of this Ogbonge competition <laughs> will make you now become face of Zikel top model. What do you get to tell them? Thank you so much, Zikel Cosmetics, Face of Zikel, for this platform, mm. for helping young girls, you know, for empowering young girls, because not a lot of people do this, especially in times like this where there are a lot of stereotypes about women. Yeah. But thank you for building this platform to encourage young girls like myself. Mm -hmm. and. I'm really grateful and I can't wait for us to work together and achieve greater heights. Thank you so much. Are they ready to meet the next guest who I get for the studio? Winner. <laughs> Winner's not in the MV. So she should be face of Zikel Tourism and her name na Ore. But I will let her do a proper introduction because her name long passed like that. So let her tell you her name by herself and tell us what she does as well. How are you doing? Very fine. My <laughs> name is Oreji Ama. I'm a YouTuber and professional video editor. Mm, yes. Nice. And I'm face of Zika Tourism. Now, that's a good one. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So, um, how do you feel being face of Zika Tourism? Wait, first, before we, before we even start, you sabi speak pigeon? Of course, very much. Nguano, <laughs> hit me. So, tell me, how you take the feel, say you be face of Zika Tourism? <laughs> um, I feel really honored and grateful. Mm. 
because for camp, mm. the challenge where we face. Yeah, we. Ah, no be here. Mm. <laughs> it was very um, tactful and I'm grateful to be here. All honestly. right. Nice one. Nice Thank one. You. So what was the most challenging aspect of the whole competition for you? Which parts really, really challenged you well, well as a person? Okay. Um, I'm going to be honest. For the most part, mm. Almost all the trainings we had was very intense because we are coaches, they know they smile, mm, you know. They, okay. I, I'm not like they are rude or anything, but they're going to remind you at every point that you are here to work. And in as much as, even if you're not ready, mm. they have to prove themselves with you. Yeah. So they're like their portfolio as at that time. Yeah. So we had to like level up this app. Mm-hmm. And, or you'll be dropped. Uh, right? <laughs> that kind of a thing. <laughs> yeah. And all their reputation is at stake and they wouldn't want to ruin that. Mm -hmm, so having mm -hmm. that in mind, every time we try to mess up, yeah. remember that oh coach media is here, coach smart is here, and we have to just chin up. And for me, the um catwalk training was really intense because mm. I have been on a pageant before, but it wasn't like this. Okay. The training was different from everything I know yeah. and I'm really grateful to like be part of it and when it came to our presentations of course it's a cosmetic um, brand yeah so we had to like do so many makeup and I'm not like a makeup artist but of course I can get the work done but yeah. when you talk about the professional hand I don't have that <laughs> so it was really I came first okay one of our challenges eventually and I was like, okay worry, go for it <laughs> so it was really um taxful and what else the fact that we have to wake up early at five thirty. <laughs> it was for nine days. Oh my god, it was it was But at the stressful. end of the day, ba like English people go talk, the end justifies the means. Yeah. yeah. So after all that hard work, we're here. It paid off. It paid off. <laughs> yeah, place of Zikel tourism. So keep yeah. tour everywhere terrible. Definitely. You know, spreading the good news about the brand that uh has put you in this position yeah. our next question one go on one ask you we say as face of zikel tourism now what's your intent to use this office and use this position to do for the society <sighs> okay so i remember um our second day in camp yeah walking into our hotel rooms right they had like um the former queens the crowns and everything mm. the names was there so i just randomly said to one of the girls my um pageant sisters i was like oh god they should better give me something i can honestly work with mm. and then she says which one do you want i'm like tourism okay so I just manifested speak it that. into existence do you get All right. so when i said that randomly honestly i didn't even remember i said that until i got it and i looked at myself I'm like tourism <laughs> okay girl <laughs> manifesting so when i said that and honestly, I like I said, I wanted something I can honestly work with. Okay. And I'm a videographer, but mostly I create content on YouTube. And I love to travel. Mm. Within my six years in school in Abia, I took out a little time to do interstate traveling. I, I feel, think I've gone to all the states in Nigeria, nice. if I'm not mistaken. Interesting. So I'm like super, super excited. And I said next year I want to go to that. I want to visit so many countries and document that on YouTube. All right. I mean, you can if you go to my YouTube channel, you can tell this girl loves what she. Just no so check having it out. this, <laughs> trust me, I'm going to be exploring and I'm making sure to tag you. Oh, right. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Interesting because I could then tell them, say, I don't meet Ori. And know, again, Queen. Okay, and, and again, of... for um the brand, mm -hmm. obviously on my YouTube channel, I'm going to carry the brand along. Definitely. And for me, YouTube is like the most reliable platform to like advertise any product. Okay. And um, for my project, I think I'm just going to keep that to myself till I start to do it. All right. <laughs> we'll keep an eye out for you. All right. So finally, what do you get to tell the organizers of this competition when you participate in? What's your message to them? <sighs> to my coaches, thank you so much for constantly reminding me that I'm that deal and I'm the main character in my story. Coach Mide is really inspiring. The story mm. is thumbs up to you and to the CEO and everybody in charge thank you so much for believing in me thank yeah. you so much for seeing something in me that I did not even see and super grateful and trust me you're not going to um, regret picking me up as one of your queens I'm really grateful and honored nice one interesting <laughs> thank you so much now it's time to chat with Salamat that is her name she looks Indian I didn't want to tell her before the cameras came on <laughs> but she looks like an Indian girl, a dark England yeah you actually How's that? Ah, 
Ah, no wonder. Fine gay. All right, so introduce yourself. Tell them your name. You sabi speak pidgin English? Yes, now when you speak Sorry. Ungwado. Uh, all right, now. So introduce yourself using pidgin. Introduce yourself. Tell us your name. Tell us what you they do. Mm -hmm. And tell us face of Zikiel, what you be. Okay. Hi, guys. My name is Salamat Al Hassan. I be face of Zikiel Africa. I be celebrity makeup artist, mm. beauty influencer. You know, so that's so what they do for you. <laughs> and you be the face of Zikiel? Africa. Nice one. <laughs> All right. So, how the competition take be for you? How you go fit take describe the whole process? We bring you up to the point so you can win this uh, mm. part when you win. So I would say very fantastic okay. from the camp. Very energetic and, you know, they push us where to really get them, you know. Mm. So on that day, we're not disappointed. So I'm happy that... Are they part of this kind of situation, you know? Are they happy and genuinely happy? Nice one. Yeah. All right, so being say you come from the north, and we know how, you know, northern has a day very, very particular very, yes, with yes. dressing nice and moderately mm -hmm, and all of mm -hmm. that. How did you feel like when you told your parents you wanted to go and do this competition? Uh, first of all, my parents, they allow me to do it I want to because they nice. say I fit to it and I suppose to. Mm. If I put my mind for them, I go do well and... Dressing moderate and bring, you know, looking good is part of me already. So even <laughs> yeah. though I dress, you know, short skirt, and they try to wear long sleeve, and they try just combine them, you know, so that they Mix go there happy. Up, yes. You know, me say I go there happy, you know, and yeah, first of the they really try. They allow us even wear within we won't oh, wear, yeah, even nice though word. there was a list. But you know, dress moderate, you know, that's actually part of be decent. The situation be <laughs> decent, you know, and part still decent yet sexy. That kind of thing. you know, give it to us, but just be decent. You know? <laughs> <laughs> nice, interesting stuff. Yeah. All right, so um. Um, because why I make that comment, we say, I know say most of the time, you don't get person who come visit me for bid zone before we actually talk, say, Northerners, not today participate for competition. Yeah, I, I was the only Northerner. Can you imagine? I was the only Northerner. Yeah, because I know. Because see, I even <laughs> win safe, can't even make her more, you know, yeah. mad, gone, You can't be like an inspiration to yes, some other girls yes. who won't do this kind of thing and if you, they fear. If you watch the videos, you will see how I combine my outfit as well. Nice. You go like them for sure. So <laughs> <laughs> it be your message now to your <laughs> so fellow Northerners girls when they watch you uh, what do you get to tell them say may you allow yourself do it you won't do if you feel like to do something may you run them um, as far as you know say you fear god and you know it's all about you at the end of the day your mm -hmm. parents know if you live the life where you won't live you know they feel just put you through but listen to your parents but at the same time let them understand your decision because they go always understand no matter what nice they go always understand no yeah. and when you even win the millions you mm -hmm. know they go you know that when you start the work they bring money come us. they go happy now you guys <laughs> work mommy take this one million for Shopping. Yes, now the guys <laughs> happy now for sure. Definitely. Yeah. All right. So with your position now, face of Zikel Africa, what do you intend to do for your society, for, society. for your community? What do you go fit uh, You know, a lot of uh, makeup out there. Most mm. people think they makeup now color color. Mm. But if you see my face, I get makeup like this, but yeah. just very cute, very natural. So I would like people. I would like many people use face of um, Zikel cosmetics. May they try them out. Okay. May they not say. Makeup is not all about colors. It's not all about. It's about you putting things together and making sure you are fine. Yeah. So I go want to inspire young girls. Me they actually do makeup. Me they try explore. Me they grow in that knowledge in that aspect. Learn about the natural tones. Learn about how to make yourself up without looking too extra. Mm. You know, present yourself well. The message one I want to make you send finally. The final mm. person I want to make you send message now to the organizers of Face of the Care. What do you get to tell them? I got to tell them say thank you for bringing out this kind of opportunity. Yeah. Thank you for allowing the young girls to feel inspired. You know, young girls out there, they always look for things that are inspiring them because so many things are on the street and it's not easy to stay grounded. Mm. So thank you for bringing girls, women, a lot of women all over Nigeria coming together and mm -hmm. we were only 30 in the camp from different states. Nice. You try, go on, like you do well. <laughs> so thank you. And you know, your deals, eh? Make sure say they give us better deals so, because we'll be fine, fine girls. We know how to carry ourselves. So, tell about we just say you our life, you know. Yeah, thank you at the end of the day. Thank you. Nice word. I really thank like you. your energy. Very thank good. You. Interesting interview. Thank and uh, I must say, you grew up for Lagos. Yes, for Ogba. 
people. No wonder. This one uh, mixed breed not yes, she don't turn you Yoruba gay. <laughs> All right, so thank you so much for coming yeah, on the show. Thank you so enjoy much. your career, like enjoy space. everything thank here. You. We, we like you having so you here too. Thank you. Yeah, welcome. Have nice I have <laughs> the very last guest in the studio this afternoon, and she's indeed me will be gay. Me will be girl, and they say this girl they very, very, very beautiful. And I make she win face of Zikel International. She be the gong, gong, gong queen. Gone. Once you see queen, we wear red crown. No, say now be the person. Yeah. Her name that gold. Welcome to the studio. Thank you. How you doing? I'm very well. How are you doing? I'm alright. Sitting beside a pretty girl, I'm fine. Every, all my all my worries are gone. <laughs> Not oh just one pretty God. girl. Four pretty girls. Four. You know they were coming one after the other, and yeah. now we are here. So how do you feel being here? I feel good, actually. I really feel good. And I want to ask you, have you speak pigeon English? No. Hey, wait. Go down for my hand. Oh. My pigeon is very <laughs> funny. It sounds like a lot of language. <laughs> She says, um, she says it's very funny that it sounds like another language. Speak the word you can't speak. Can you try at all? All right, okay, sure, I'll try. All right, so use okay. that pigeon English now. Introduce yourself to people where they watch for house. Tell them your name okay. and tell them what you they do. All right, okay. <laughs> so, my name na Gold is in Naya. Mm -hmm. I'm a student and a face model. Okay. I'm 20 years old and um, I'm Face of Secure International 2022. Nice, what a good portfolio. <laughs> and uh, she's still a student. Interesting stuff. So, how do you feel? How was it like for you? How did the competition take go, the build up, up until you get into this point where you now became uh, Face of Secure International? How did you feel when you even won? You know, tell me about everything. <laughs> Winning, like when they announced my name, yeah. winner, I was so surprised. I was shocked, honestly, because I didn't really see coming. Oh. But then I was so, and I was happy mm -hmm. actually, because mm -hmm. all my efforts were not in vain. Because I put in a lot of work. Okay. During the camp, I was always up early, five thirty. We are like, you have to be downstairs by <coughs> seven a.m. I'm always there, like five minutes, ten minutes before that time. So I actually put in the work. So I yeah. was really happy that my all my hard work paid off and I'm really grateful to God for, my level. <laughs> for this opportunity. Yeah. So, yes. Hard work they always pay off. You know when they say when you read, when you study. Because you're a student of course you should yeah. know that part. So they say yeah. hard work pays off. So put in the hard work. Yeah, exactly. Anyways, I'm happy it paid off for you. So um what was the most memorable moment of everything? Apart from you winning of course. Okay. What other moment was the most memorable for you? Uh, okay, I think it was when we did, there's this challenge we did during the camp. Um, I actually have two memory mo okay. memorable mo moments. Tell well, me I'll about talk about them. Yeah, so the first one, we had this um, no less than, no sorry, no more than, I mean, no less than four colors okay. on your face where you had to like play with different colors and okay. all of that. So I was trying to beat the time, I'm giving like five minutes for that challenge. So it was like very tough. And actually did well. Uh, I was not even expecting to get to the top three because I was third. So I was happy that I you did well. Yeah, on I that did one. well on that one. <laughs> and also, um, there was this session we had one of our catwalk coaches, okay. Coach Me Day. Yeah. And he really took his time out and he spoke to each and every one of us. And it felt like a really heart to heart conversation with all thirty one of us in mm. the camp. And it was so nice getting to share experiences and talk okay. about life and everything. So, yeah, that was really, really, really memorable for me. Interesting. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, how your family take react? Say you, student, 20, won't go try this competition out. Do you live in Lagos? <laughs> yes, I live in Lagos. Okay. Live in Lagos. Okay. So, how did they feel like you saying, I want to try out Face of Zikel, I want to do this. What okay, did they say so to you? At first, I was scared to tell my dad. Ah, that is <laughs> always oh, scary. <laughs> yeah. But I told my mom. And she was like, yes, you should actually go for Mothers it. Mothers are always like yes. that. <laughs> so I, I registered and it took me a while to even tell my dad that, oh, I registered for this thing. I mean, when I told him, I went for the first audition and I was among among the top four. Okay. And I came back and I told him about it. So he was really excited. And then I told him that we were going to go to, to a camp. camp. Okay. So that was where the issue was. Drama and he was started. like, <laughs> You have to be, you have to go back to school. Like you have to go back to school. Yeah. There's no camp and all of that. So I told him I'm going to come back to Lagos. And he was like, I don't want to see you in Lagos. <laughs> <laughs> and he was saying, Oh, you know, what school are you in? Um, Nandia University. Oh, so you have to travel. Yes, to come I have. To Lagos. Yes, exactly. No wonder. I don't so, want to see you. Because like, I told me freaking in Lagos. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> <laughs> My guy spoke his language. Honestly, so you hear so, where? But I just knew that. 
I'm actually coming and I mm-hmm. went on, I meet plants with chance. my mom, yes, and finally I told him like Mothers. days <laughs> before me entering the girls. <laughs> and she already like spoke to him already. She was so 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 supportive. Mm. And when I came back to the girls, my dad was the one that even helped me pack my bag oh, to camp. He folded of all day. of my dresses. <laughs> he arranged like even when I go to camp, other girls were like, How did you pack all of these clothes inside this tiny book? I'm like, it was my dad. Oh. So not and, all superheroes wear capes. Yeah, exactly. That is that is a super Heroes. Yes, and he kept on calling me every day, telling uh-huh. me, oh, I'm going to vote for you, I'm going to tell my friends to vote for you. And he even got some of his friends to also call me, and they called me literally every single day. That's so he was there on the grand final. He was the first person that ran off stage. <laughs> Yeah, he announced me as, as the winner and he gave me a really big hug. So uh, I'm really grateful that he actually supported me and it really, really, really means a lot to nice. me that I got the support from my parents. Nice yes. one, nice one. But yes. some parents don't even know that their support means that much to us. So, but yeah. thank God that your dad eventually came around yes. and here you are, yeah. making him proud. Exactly. And uh, yeah, so moving forward, what do you want to use this year title? What are you going to use it to do in the society? Okay. Shortly, briefly, please, quickly, because <laughs> of time. So what do you intend to do with it? The okay. fact that you are face of Zikel International, what's going be the thing where they look so cute? Now this kind of thing, I will use this office to take achieve. Yeah, so I really love makeup. All so right. I'm going to um, go into beauty influencing. All right, nice. And then keep up with trends that people can come to my page to see, oh, this is how you use Zikel concealer. This is mm. how you make the blush work. This is how you use the eyeshadow and all of that. So, Teach us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be doing that. All and right. um I'm also going to empower some, like, empower girls, young mm. girls like me. There's nothing that you put your mind to that you cannot do. Hard work pays off. Anything you want to do, put in the work, put in your effort, show that you're really, really intentional. Very, Be very intentional about whatever you're doing and All you're right. going to get it by God's grace. Nice. So, yes. Be intentional. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and finally, to the organizers of Face of Zikel competition, what do you have to say? Honestly, I love you guys so much. <laughs> <laughs> they know already, I'm sure. Thank you. Thank you, Face of Zikel. Thank you, Zikel Cosmetics. I really, really, really am grateful for this opportunity. Yeah. And I'm really happy that I get to represent this wonderful, wonderful brand. Prestigious brand. Exactly. Let me grow you. The, let me grow you. Vocabulary. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. Yes. Thank you, guys. Thank you, everyone. I'm really, really, really grateful. And I'm going to make you all proud. Yeah. <laughs> and this is me saying thank you to you, my viewers at home. I'm going to stick come back. I get one more music break for now. Don't go anywhere. I'm saying thank you because now they always stick with me. Now they always watch my shows. And I know so now I don't enjoy this one thoroughly. I mean, beautiful ladies. Four now, I carry con give on now. <laughs> and I say, Unafi, pick wife. But I've changed my mind. I'm not giving anyone to you again. Stay on your own. <laughs> they are... <laughs> Queens, let's leave them at that. So thank you so much.